The Colorado Center for the Blind. Take charge with confidence and self-reliance. I wanted to show you my shop project. It is a uh, spice rack, and, and more specifically, I call it my savory spice rack because I ended up going to a little shop in downtown Littleton that sold these spices, so I wanted to build the spice rack to fit the bottles. Um, it's made of red oak, uh, wrought iron posts, and then um, wiring that goes around the back of the shelving to hold the spice bottles in. The process to making the spice rack was actually um, quite involved. I used a number of different power tools, uh, including the miter saw, the table saw, the planer, uh, a router, and a drill press. And then with a hacksaw, I actually cut the iron, uh, the the wrought iron rods, and we created a, a lip from the same board and used the router to give it more of a detail and uh, just a prettier look to it. So, and then after all that work was done. I sanded down the wood and then later conditioned it, used a stain and then a, a sealer to, you know, just in case there were any spills or something down the road that I could be easy to clean up. And then just um, bolted the, the shelves onto the rods and here's my finished project. I have to say that in addition to just, you know, being able to take this back with me to show the work that I uh, I was able to complete just that whole process when I went into the home maintenance class I was terrified of table saws I didn't even like the sound of them and the idea of using all these different power tools was really uh, it, it did uh, create some anxiety <laughs> but you know Chris Kenny was a great instructor and he walked me through it and showed me you know, with really without any accommodation, how I can actually just, it's something that you can purchase in, you know, with the proper training that you can use. And it just overall it really helped build my confidence and, you know, brought out some of my creativity. So it was, it was more than just the going through the motions of building something. I actually built something inside me. To learn more about the Colorado Center for the Blind, visit our website at www.cocenter.org or call 303-778-1130.